Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to some more Game of Thrones and Crusader Kings 2 with the Dothraki campaign. It's been a little while since we visited this campaign. I haven't quite given up on it yet, but I mean, I'm not too far off from giving up on it, but you know, not not quite yet. Maybe we'll play for a little while longer. And uh, since we haven't played in a while, let's quickly take a look around the map. So we are doing a raid on... Ka... Ka... What? Kosrak? Kosrak? Kosrak, yes. Doing a raid on that. We do have all these guys that are uh, hostile to us because we've been marching our armies through their lands while they were raiding. Still really not happy with the way that works, but I guess it's it's a game mechanic that I got to deal with. I still feel like you should be able to walk through your own people's lands without actually raiding them, but you know, I guess I guess that's that. And they will be hostile with us uh, or against us for for a while. For a hell of a long time. So, yeah. Well, like, what is that? That's 12, 1,200 days. So that's like four years, roughly. Yeah. Oh, well. Uh, we do have... An open cow. Oh, yeah, the Kolak. Mm, but we can't assign anybody there. Maybe we can hire somebody. We do have a little bit of money. Let's employ a... Like, a holy man, I guess? Sure, I don't know if that'll work, but hey, good, it did work. Perfect. There you go, I don't know what you do, but I'm sure it's something useful. Maybe, actually... Put him on the shaman position instead. Uh, I guess I would have to fire... Ah, whatever, forget it, we'll just leave it as it is. All right, cool. So we got that going. Any titles? We do have some titles we could probably give away here. And nope, no eunuchs, no dwarves. Master of the horse. Oh yeah, we don't have any ranking people under us. It's too bad our son, our heir, is craven. Otherwise, he's not terrible, but the craven is kind of unfortunate. You can be the master of the horse. Um... I don't really care about any of those. I don't, like, honestly, I don't even know if there's a real reason to have these honorary titles given out. Mainly because there's, like, I can't give it to any vassals. I can only give it to courtiers. And these positions don't really do anything other than give you opinion and, you know, salary and prestige and all that. I don't know, maybe we'll just leave it as it is. Is this our wife? No, where's our, what's our wife's name? Kajiki. Jiki, Jiki. Is that her? That's her. Alright, wife, you can be the law speaker. I like keeping my wife happy, and she can be the regent as well. Uh, maybe? Maybe not. Oh, no, never mind. I was just blind. There you go. So you can do that, and then... I still don't know if the Blood Riders actually do anything. Oh, I can't assign any blood riders anyways. Okay. Yeah, whatever, that's fine. Council's chill for the most part. Everybody's owing favors to this Mago dude. Who's who's Mago? This guy? This guy. That's fine. And the Leash Council? Are we on the council? I feel like we should be on this council. We're not on the council. Come on, guy. Put me on your damn council. Can I plot to get on the council? Who is this guy? He is... This guy. Okay. So there's no actual plots. Could rescue some people from ca captivity. There's a plot there, but... I can't do it. Chief General. Is that like the, the Marshal? No. What the hell is the Chief General? I don't know. Whatever. Any laws we can deal with? Nothing. Nothing. Nope. Okay. Armies. Can we recruit some more dudes? Not at the moment. We need more manpower. Yes. We are very low on manpower. We are gaining a little bit, though. Which is good. 
And I guess that's it. Yeah, we might as well start playing the game. Are we part of the Crown Loyalists? No, we're not. And we're never going to be. And unfortunately, we still can't declare war on any of these guys. Yep. Yeah, so the problem with this game is that there's not much we can do at the moment. We are... We're, we're doing a raid down here. A raid of Ibn. Okay. The council is discontent. Okay. That's nice. I, I don't know if the council can really do anything, but... At least they're discontent. Um, those are those dudes, and they're coming after this army. Can you guys get away? I hope so. Yeah, let's see, let's do like, like that. See if we can kind of go around them. I guess they are shattering somewhere. Raid of Omber. Call to arms. Yeah, we'll accept your call. I don't want to lose prestige. We don't have any prestige anyways. Why are we so low on prestige? Also, are you guys going to get them? April 16th, April 12th. No, we're going to get away. At least these guys aren't uh, red to me anymore. That's good. Izzy, daughter of Koholo. Is my granddaughter. Oh, okay. That's nice, I guess. Why? I don't know why she arrived at our court. I mean, she should be born in the court, no? Anyways, uh, one of the slaves in the camp says, Distinguish yourselves. Yes, okay. A uh, guy with decent stewardship. I mean, their talents will be useful, but only as far as we can sell them. It can be lonely during a long war campaign, so we can blame a man for having someone to warm his bed at night. Although it turns out one of my liaisons has resulted in a child. So I can lose a bunch of money and adopt this kid. Or wait, no character adopts Haro. Is this kid any good? Nope, nothing special. Name her a liar. Lose prestige and gain wrath, but we don't care because we already have wrath. But I guess you should be honored. <laughs> or I shall adopt the child. If we adopt him, becomes a member. My wife is angered. But we do get some piety out of it. I, I mean... Sure, we'll adopt him. Why not? We got another kid now. How upset are you? Oh, that's not so bad. Acknowledge bastard, minus 30. It's always good to have, uh... I mean, it's, he's not a backup. He's a backup for the backup. Alright, you guys still getting away? Good. Slowly sieging these down. Now... I wonder, should I maybe go after his army and just smush it? Hmm. Because I'm kind of afraid of him taking my capital. And if he does, then I don't really know how that's going to work. Another slave with more decent stewardship. Okay, well, we're going to be selling you. I still wonder, like, what happened to the menu? There was the, the whole slave management menu. I feel like that's... It was really useful, but it's non-existent. All right, you are the slave, yes. Sell slave. Time to do business. Come on, give me something good. 15 ducats, I mean, to my liege. Right, let's keep trying. Maybe we'll get like a 45 or something. I'll take the next offer. Hopefully it shows up soon. Come on. Same guy. He's He really wants her. Okay, well, there you go, my friend. And then the other guy was Haro or something? No, not Haro. Hago. A Lazarine. We will sell you as well. 75. Also to my liege. Whatever, that's fine. Money is good. Can't use the money for anything right now. Maybe some upgrades. Nope, we already have an upgrade coming in. Alright. Just want to keep an eye on this army. They are going to Reish... Where? Rish Tehen. They are going to my capital. Shit. So, um, yeah. I don't really know how that's gonna work if they take my capital. Hopefully it doesn't just give them 100% war score. That would be 
unfortunate. And let's make sure we are leading armies and our main heir is leading an army as well. Okay, good. Because if he does take it, I don't want to get captured and then have to give up the war because of it. It does take forever to move around up here. Alright, we have that siege done. We could sit here for another... Like, uh, 48 days, I guess, to finish this. Get a bit more money. You know what? I mean... I could just end it right now. He gave me 42 ducats this way. But this way I would make sure that he doesn't actually take my capital and, and do anything bad here. So yeah, I'm just gonna end the war. How long is it gonna take you? June 26th. Oh, you got four days, yeah. No, nope, we'll just end the war. Cool, so we got our 42 ducats. Most importantly, we got the slave camp levels. We have a large slave camp now. Damn, son. I thought there was a way to sell slave camp levels. Again, it was under the the slave management thing, which is not here anymore. I wonder, like, is that because we're not the the top liege? Or th I don't know. I really don't know. How are we doing with the inheritance here? On the I guess that's the Kalasar. So we need to... Clan chiefs with more prestige than the heir get claims on the Kalasar. With more prestige than the heir. He's got 108 prestige. We have 152. So we do have more. Our son, unfortunately, does not. Why are you... I can't remember now. I, I, I know there was... I did some... There was some event that caused him to lose a lot of prestige. But I can't remember what the event was. Was it... Did I get him to marry somebody? Wait, how do you have kids? Oh, with uh, your concubine, I guess. No. Oh, your lover. Can we... I mean, she's a courtier. I don't, I don't really want to make her the wife, because that's just going to be more prestige that he's going to lose. Another 400 prestige. Yeah, no. That's... No. No, thank you. Let's get you married off to... Man, are you going to lose prestige regardless? No. Or the relative of a call. Okay. And all these other ones are just courtiers. Yeah. Alright, well, well, we'll get you married off to... What are you, the daughter of, of the call? Yep. Alright, that's fine. That'll do. And son number two also needs to get married... Yeah, you can marry one of these courtiers. Marry this one. Man, I, I really don't want to make him lose all this much prestige, though. That just seems kind of silly. But there's nothing else I can do. They're gonna... I could get him married off to the youngest daughter, but she's way younger than him. Uh, six-year-olds... I would love it if I could... Yeah, like this one. No. What? Why is it showing her first? Yeah, it's still minus 300. And the lower down we go, the... Yeah, they're all just gonna be... Like, they have they have names. Like, the ones with names. Oh, but these, are, these ones are old. Alright, we'll just go for the... The oldest one here. This one. There you go. Got a couple of betrothals in there. And can we now maybe declare war on somebody else? Lord Jomo is independent. Oh, right. Okay. We need a ton more prestige. Well, shit, son. That's great. Alright, let's just go home, I guess, for now. And I suppose, yeah, we do need to recover our forces a little bit, so... We are gonna, I guess, lose some manpower every once in a while. It'll probably be a little while before we can... ...start building more troops. Jaco has been a leal... 
Again with the Leal, I'm pretty sure that's supposed to say loyal, but you know. Having successfully completed many tasks in aid of Temo, it would be seen as the right and honorable course to reward him. He's my Jeratuk, which is what? That is the steward. So I could give him some money, make him like me a little better, owe him a favor, or I owe him nothing. Six ducats. I mean, six ducats is not a whole hell of a lot. There you go. You can, you can have your six ducats. Good job, pal. Thank you for doing your job. Hmm, that's... I'm gonna... I'm, hmm, I'm debating maybe murdering or trying to murder some of these guys. No, we don't have... We don't stand a chance. Nope. That's no good. I would still like to... Wait, how do you have a feud? I thought the... The Kalasar, like the... The leader, wasn't able to have feuds with anybody. Maybe that was there from before? I don't know. I am still trying to maybe form a blood oath with this guy. I still want to accept your proposal. I guess there's a, a cooldown timer on it somewhere. So I gotta I gotta make him like me a little bit more. Do we have somebody better here? This guy that hates me. Enslaved me. Who are you guys? Oh, these guys must be from from when we did this war, we got the three slaves. Well, I'm just gonna sell them. Because I really don't need slaves. I guess they're at the bottom. <clears throat> so, sell slave. I'm gonna do business. What do we got? Tall stewardship? Maybe you get like 75 ducats or something? Mm, maybe, possibly, at some point today. Would be great. Come on, game. I'll even take the five ducats. Fifteen, that's fine. What is that? New important... No, I don't want to send spoils of war to Dosh Kaleen. They don't do shit for me. Send him a slave, get some piety against... Oh, I guess I could gain prestige that way, which would allow me to maybe declare another war. But I also don't want to lose 250 ducats, seeing as how I really don't make a whole hell of a lot. So we'll hold off on that for now. Maybe we'll... Maybe I'll change my mind. Actually, I think the best way to figure out who the slaves are is to sort by opinion and just look here. Yeah, enslave me. Sell slave. I don't even care what your traits are. I don't really care at all. I'll just take the first deal. 15 ducats. Done. And you? Yes. Come on, give me some good. Ooh, 40 ducats. Really? 40 ducats for her? Okay. <laughs> sure. My liege is kind of an idiot. God, he's got a lot of prestige though. Holy shit. I just... I don't know. I I have no idea how I'm possibly going to take over the Kalasar. It... It'll de we'll definitely have to wait. There's no way we can do it in this go-around. I was hoping that maybe he would implode or something, but... No, he's got like... Everybody that likes him. Other than, like, I'm the lowest, and then this guy that's in jail. Everybody else is totally chill with him. Especially these two guys, protecting me from enemy. Oh, no, I thought I thought that was those guys that I declared war on, or I declared a feud with, and I couldn't actually declare war on because the guy was a jerk and made me lose a whole bunch of prestige. Alright, well, I think it's about time to call the episode, but I do want to, before I do that, I want to wait for this building to finish. Perfect, we got a shrine in there. What does the shrine do again? Shrine gives us, ah, pop growth, yes, that's useful. We need pop growth. Because we lose quite a bit from, from the manpower. Also, Rish, Tehen, minus 7%. What is, what is that? Is it... I don't I don't actually know. Is your capital always like going to give it a negative modifier to it? Cause it's not destroyed, right? Hmm. I don't know, at least we got a whole whole lot of slaves. That's good. 
I think that's one more level and we're at capped, yeah. I wish I could sell these, man. That'd be so sweet. Anyways, um, let's look for garrison size. Ooh, tax. That might be good. So we have another pop growth there and more pop growth there and tax as well. Let's build some cattle pens. All right. And yeah, we're going to leave the episode off here. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, you know what to do with them. Likes, comments, all that good stuff down below. And I'll catch you in the next episode where we, again, are not able to do much. But maybe I'll figure out something to do. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, if you guys enjoyed, you know what to do again. And I'll see you next time. I like repeating myself. Isn't it great? <laughs> Take care, everybody.